I remember watching Hoyt's Gracie and uh, just I was intrigued by how he was able to beat bigger guys with the technique. And, uh, you know, I, I played a lot of sports growing up. I kind of got upset with the politics of team sports, so I, I decided to give it a try and, you know, I just fell in love. I love martial arts, I love everything about it. I love how it's, it's technical, it's, it's beautiful, it's, uh, it takes everything that, that you can give, you know, to compete in this sport. And, uh, um, you know, I'm able to pro provide for my family and uh, it's just a lot of fun. I guess, you know, I started when I was 15 years old and at that point I, I paid for my martial arts lessons myself. So. Uh, my dad actually really liked it. My mom was a, l a little worried at first, uh, but you know, pretty much through the years, they've supported me 100%. My, my wife has been to every single one of my fights since we've been married, uh, except one where, where she couldn't make because it was in Germany. Uh, but uh, you know, my my 11 year old daughter, she. She loves it. She's taking jiu-jitsu lessons, and she she likes watching my fights. And and um, honestly, it's for my family. It's it's really a blessing. Uh, there are some hard things about it, like when I have to travel, or just you know be coming home and being tired and not having the energy to to you know ride bikes or give piggyback rides and stuff like that. But. Uh, aside from that stuff, it's, it's really a blessing for my family. I get so much quality time with them that if I was working a nine to five job, uh, I wouldn't be able to do that. Since I was a kid, I always wanted to be the best at whatever I was doing. Um, whatever sport I was playing or even in school, I just, I was very competitive. I've, I've always wanted to be the best and, you know, just being good was never good enough. I wanted to be the best, I wanted to be perfect in my technique. I've always been really hard on myself uh, with mistakes or, you know, uh, losses and things like that. So, um, in my motivation when I wake up in the morning, it, it, you know, I think a lot of it comes from that, just just uh, wanting to be the best. And, and I know it takes hard work and, and dedication. Thinking back in my career, uh, especially my early years, there were, there were some fights where I mean, I could have easily given up, or you know, not even consistent, not even calling it giving up. I've, I could have um, lost the fight, and I, uh, you know, it wouldn't have been looked down upon uh, or looked at as quitting. But you know, I was just able to to dig deep and and pull out a win, and. Um, you know, there were fights uh, before I was fighting in Japan, there were fights when I fought in Japan, and, and there were uh, even fights in, in the UFC that, uh, you know, I really f feel like uh, I, I gave 100%.